What's up guys, so the notch maker, the headphone jack killer, the trendsetter Apple is about to make another bold move. The iPhone 12 family is looking pretty good, but next year things will go crazy. Apple will make a decision that could change the direction of smartphones as they have done it before. So next year there will be iPhone 12 kind of models that are similar to the iPhone 12 series with some new bells and whistles, but there will be one model that has that bold move. A portless iPhone 13. Yes, an iPhone with no charging port. This will indeed going to be a one-of-a-kind smartphone. Apple refused to use USB-C. It's rumored that this is the last year that they're gonna go with the lightning cable and next year they will go portless. The charging port is something that we have used since I don't know the dawn of phones. This is to kick off that true wireless era. Ming Shiko also said that the most high-end iPhone model will be completely wireless. This means that we'll have to charge the iPhone using a wireless charger. Apple is also getting rid of the wired earphones this year and next year there will be no wired charger out of the box meaning the unboxing experience of the iPhone 13 will be very different. Perhaps we could see the AirPods and a new wireless charger out of the box. It's a strong bold direction indeed but it's not as simple as getting rid of the headphone jack. If you look at the Android world we have brands like Oppo, Xiaomi, they have wired fast charging solutions of up to 65 watts. That is some crazy fast charging speeds while these brands are also working on crazy wireless charging speeds having that special wireless charger is also the challenge. But for Apple fast charging was never the goal. They even shipped the iPhone 11 with a 5 watt charger so clearly that is not what they are concerned with. The wireless charger with the iPhone 13 is said to be similar to air power that would charge multiple devices. No rumors on anything else but don't hope for crazy speeds. The portless future is inevitable. Once Apple successfully pulls this off, it's only a matter of time that other brands will follow as well similar to the removal of headphone jack. Now portless iPhone is also said to be full screen. Multiple rumors and leaks points to a full screen screen notch free iPhone in 2021. There's a leak that says that Apple will push the sensors in the upper bezel of the phone. But according to Mako Takara, the Japanese news source, they claim that iPhone 13 will have under screen camera technology. The disclaimer here is that this is just one prototype model that is currently being tested. So we don't know that it's going to be the final model. So keep that in mind. It's rumored to utilize Samsung's under panel sensor technology. Next year, Samsung is also implementing the under screen camera camera so Apple could have something similar planned but it's not just the camera that Apple has to hide they also have to deal with the face ID sensor so it's a bit more complicated when you add that a true depth camera system it's gonna be interesting to see how they will pull this off we have also seen the under screen touch ID patents an under screen touch ID could drastically benefit iPhone's design the under screen fingerprint scanners in 2021 will sport multi-finger authentication while having a larger scanning area with fast speeds. In fact, the Galaxy Note 20 models are already expected to use the Qualcomm 3D Sonic scanners this year, so next year it will definitely be a major deal. Maybe now Apple could see the benefit of using the in-screen Touch ID as a good alternative option. One thing is clear, the iPhone 13 will be changing the smartphone game forever. A wireless future is truly coming. Also, we have rumored camera specs of the iPhone 13 model. This is highly early details, so take that with grain of salt. Apple is rumored to be testing a bigger camera sensors with the resolutions up to 64 megapixel, periscope zooms, anamorphic lenses. Uh, all this is very interesting. Uh, next year will definitely be a huge, huge year for Apple. So yeah, that is all for today's news. What do you think about the bold Apple move? Do you think that one day we'll have Samsung devices with portless design? Do you think it's the ultimate direction? Drop your comment and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Out.